Fallon Taylor, little lady with a great challenge in front of her. This is Flo. Baby Flo. <laughs> she wins the world championship. And the winner's circle for that cowgirl. And the victory lap. Ellen Taylor will win. She's riding a new horse, a young horse, out of a champion flow. She has absolutely been unstoppable. What's up, Flomies? Welcome back to my channel. You guys, the collab is happening. <laughs> Lolo is here and she's got a new jockey for today and no, it's not C-Money. Um, we are here at a really, really, really special person's place. We're at Ruckman Ranch where we are going to be riding Rainers and showing Matt Mills how to ride a barrel horse. You guys, this is the most fun collab I've ever, ever, ever done because I'm such a reigning horse fan. Um, Kelsey that does the rehab on Baby Flo, she turned me into a reigning fan extraordinaire. I watch raining day and night, eat, live, and breathe it. Plus, my friend Melissa, um, she texted me and she was like, hey, have you heard of Matt Mills? You've got to check out his stuff. So we're here at Matt Mills Raining. I am a subscriber of mattmillsraining.com, and I can't wait for us to do um, horse swap today. So you guys, welcome. I'm so excited. I'm nervous. I get to ride a rainer. I'm freaking out a little bit. So let's get after it. Okay, you guys, the collab is here. <laughs> this is Matt Mills. I'm a huge fan of Matt Mills and all things Matt Mills. Likewise. Thank you. And so I'm a subscriber, mattmillsraining.com. You guys go check it out. Um, it would be a great um, collab to Horse Boss Challenges, learning new skills. You guys have seen me do jumping and every discipline I can try, I've done it. So very big fan, very much recommended, supplemental to anything you're doing barrel racing. The videos are super interactive and he even has some Spanish videos. You guys know we're 213 days into learning Spanish. so. Um, wow. I learned on one of the videos how to make my horses back better. Nice. So, <laughs> you've been guys, watching for you, sure. For That's sure. great. Um, if you guys are Matt Mills subscribers, if you're not, go subscribe to Matt Mills on YouTube um, and check that out. But I'm in the barn. I'm in the barn. <laughs> I use the bathroom in the <laughs> in the bathroom thing with the lighting fixtures and the wine wall. I don't drink any alcohol, but the wine wall is amazing. Okay, this is Matt's gorgeous <laughs> wife, Karen. Come on in. She better get in She's here. She's who made this happen. <laughs> exactly. So, ish. <laughs> yes, you did this. So, yeah. um, Matt has a ton of horses here, but Karen has a bunch of really cute horses. There's the gray horse. Oh, yeah, Smokey. Yeah, Smokey. Smokey. We yeah. actually sold him. And I yeah. saw him for sale. I was like, yeah. he's going to be gone tomorrow. Yeah, he and was. And then Bruce. Yeah. Oh, sorry. And yep. then Bruce. you had a sorrel mare that I saw. Name starts with an L. Lily. Yeah, Lila. Lila. Now I sold her. Yeah. I, I have time for one horse. And sometimes I don't Man. even have time for him. So, he's all I have right with now. With all you guys have yeah. going on, we understand. Yeah. We get yeah. It. yeah. So we're gonna have, I, I teared up because I get the opportunity, thank you to Mary Beth for allowing me to ride your horse Shiny Work Loose because that's like my dream. <laughs> yeah. And it actually gets to happen today and I'm putting Matt on my best barrel horse, Lolo, who you guys have all seen. Um, and she's acting like a kid pony right now. Very much so. So I'm really excited. <laughs> like I don't want this to be like, you know, make fun of Matt running barrels. <laughs> I would like for you to have fun and really enjoy it and just show us Especially if I could learn something, you know, if you put a horse in a better position than than I do, by all means, I'd love to leave here with more than one trick. Yeah, I'm looking forward to great. checking it out. It's gonna be yeah. fun. Yeah. Okay, well, let's go give you some pointers before you get started, because I'm gonna need a three-hour <laughs> tutorial to do mine. You need five minutes. <laughs> I'll take I'll take any advice <laughs> okay. you can give me. Yeah. Okay. Saddle horns an advantage. It's not, you know, we don't have points deducted for anything but hitting barrels. So if you want to grab the saddle horn and just kind of have your hand slid down. But if you are inside rain, then I take inside it. rain. If you're a little in the middle, it's over. You got to be really slid down and kind of lead them around, kind of like a snaffle bitter. Yeah. They're gonna move with their shoulders across and not move their hind end, like yours would. You know, you want yours to come across themselves, where ours need to move this way. Um, and as you run across the pin, you'll change your hands like this. You pick your spot in the dirt. And then when your leg is even with the barrel, that's when you would just sit down and drop. And then you want to look kind of over your shoulder like a rollback and just follow it around. Stay in the turn, though. Don't look up early and look way off. That's like a 
a lot of beginner barrel racers will look up and then look way off and forget where their horse's feet are right now. Okay. So there's if, a lot to this. You, <laughs> I mean, there's a lot to anything <laughs> at an elite right. level, yeah. right? Yeah. Like you can go, yeah. you could do this not well, you know, but yeah. an elite rider, you know, you should do it right because yeah. you're gonna be great at it. And then you run down to the third barrel, and that's where people get really distracted because it's the longest distance. Mm -hmm. So then they start like not really sure. On her, there's a tricky spot to the first barrel because I trained her for me, and so I left a hole. And so your hole is when you run into the first barrel, she's going to fall in. Okay. It's going to be up to you to just get her nose a little bit and keep her ribs out and run her up into a spot. And I'll show you, I'll put a spot in the dirt okay. everywhere that you need to put her front feet, and you'll be great. Okay. You're going to be awesome at this. All right, I'm so, kind of now getting my adrenaline up a little bit now. But you also have to hurry, <laughs> so it right. is a timed event. And now that could be good for me. I've never had a problem with going fast. Matter of yeah. fact, that I do, I have to kind of me too back off just a time. Me too. I could assume like if I were ever to show a rainer, every time like you know you get that really pretty soft little lope to the rundown, I could just hear somebody from the stands being like, "That's not loping. <laughs> slow down. You got to yeah. slow down." <laughs> so we'll get a bridle on her. All right. I'll throw my helmet down. It's not my turn yet. push her over and then go straight when you're going slow. That way when you make a run, you want to tap this thing. That's how close you want to be. Uh, okay. So, and then over here. Okay, so I'm trying to make it stay on, it's come out. Stay, yep. Right and then right here, you just want them to run straight. Okay. And you can get a little bit of her nose if you want to, mm -hmm. and then stare right here and just inhale it. Whoosh, straight to your third. Really pretty, yeah, yeah. And you'll be out about, I don't know, five feet from that barrel. You can go ahead and grab a little inside nose, pick her ribs up just a touch. Yep, and then when you get right there, you'll just let her turn. Perfect. And you can finish it a little more if she wants to step off. Okay. You can make her come back even closer if you okay. want. And then you roll until here? Yeah, don't stop. <laughs> <laughs> the gate's open, so like, you know, don't go out that. Why don't you just trot through and let's feel the ground? Because we're on raining ground, so yep. we want to make sure we're okay. If um, it's a little slick, then turn in. Right, then it would be a problem. But when you turn, go ahead and like just kind of, she's not going to trot the whole pattern. She's going to lope, so. All right. There you go. <laughs> she's doing the gated horse thing. There you go. Perfect. Perfect, perfect. Yeah. <laughs> That's perfect. Yeah. <laughs> yes. <laughs> That's perfect. <laughs> and you feel free to stop her. You're, you're fine. You do whatever you want to. That was great. That was so good. That's fun. Okay, so at the third, you see how it like takes your body and yeah. dashboards you down? So I gotta suck down. You gotta suck down. Okay. Just like you're going to a rundown, yeah. or else you're gonna end up like butt over tea kettle, like quick. Does that happen? All it happens all the time. <laughs> like you have to sit. Yeah, I know, he's ready. <laughs> we do need to interview. Okay, so you gotta sit, sit down. Sit down, like you've been punched in the gut at your barrel and you want to like watch the top of it so you can be really you know good about asking him of course matt mills got a better lead change than any human ever alive across the pin but like you know that doesn't win first in our sport so you have to turn and just gas it Go. yeah and i think it'll hold you if it won't i'll ye yell at you to pull up okay but why not gas it Oh, are you kidding me? It's the only way. <laughs> this is so cool. That. Worst thing I'll you know. Hey, we'll, You're going to be fine. We'll figure it out. We'll so, figure it out. smooch. Right, perfect. Okay. Smooch to go fast. 
finish the back side of your barrels just a little tighter, first and third. Sit on your butt. You did great. Of course you would do great. So, let's, little, but let's like haul let's butt. Slow though. Let's see what happens now. <laughs> yeah, and you kind of, to get her to run, you're gonna want to hold her just a little bit. Put your legs on her just a little bit. You might want to walk around one more time right here. And she's gonna fall in harder. Okay. So, there you go. Now you got her about where she's gonna rock and roll. She's ready. Yeah. And then just go for it. Yes. Look where you're going. Okay. <laughs> I'm take one more little loop. Yeah. <laughs> and you can go ahead and kind of pick up on her shaper just a little bit so she's there you go. There you go. Now you're good. Now haul butt. Sit down, Matt. There you go, go ahead. Yeah, go on. Hurry, hurry, hurry. Yeah, Matt. Woo! Woo, woo, woo! <laughs> that was awesome. That was so awesome. <laughs> we need to get you qualified for the American for a million. Get you qualified. That was freaking that was, awesome. That was awesome. What a good horse. Oh, thank you. She is a really oh, nice man. mare. I got up close. I'm like, just do your thing. Yeah, she's so cool. That was so awesome. That was fun. That second one, I tried to get a little closer. A little oh, man. That's a hard man. post on Instagram for sure. That was that so cool. That the pressure's on me now so bad. <laughs> so bad. Like, I saw a video of a horse running off in a rundown, and I'm just like, there. There you go. That was that'd be it. I'd kick them well, all away. You'll be good. You'll yeah. be comfortable on that. Oh. That's over so fast. Yeah. That's and so like imagine I haul to Arizona 20 hours from home and I have two runs. One is 15 seconds and one is 17 seconds. Uh, pro rodeos. Now I got jackpots here, which is great, but yeah. like we're hauling to Connecticut next week. So I can't complain when I have my four or five minute run. And no, man. No, okay. it's just for you, I feel bad because you know as a competitor when stuff's going really wrong or really right. Yeah. And you've got five minutes and just you've got to keep going. Like boiling. The first maneuver and you're like, I'm oh God. Right now. And yeah. just like missing the first barrel. You're just like, it's over. I'm going to try to, you know, make up. Salvage for something. But, and then, you know, when one thing goes bad, it's just a downward spiral of things. Yeah. That, it's that so good. Fun. Thank you for letting me ride. Hey, thank you for riding her. Hang on, I gotta take some Insta stories. Okay, so Matt absolutely crushed it. And now I get the honor of riding Mary Beth's horse, Shiny Work Boots, whose barn name is Rio. And I teared up. I had to walk to the trailer and walk it off for a second. I know what great horses cost, how much training goes into it. I'm very aware because we have our own um, very high end horses. So it's an honor. Um, so, huge thank you to Mary Beth. And, um, I'm gonna learn to ride a rainer, so let's get her unsaddled. I'm gonna pee my pants. <laughs> so, um, so I'm on way too much horse. No, I'm not. I'm on just enough horse for someone with so little knowledge as me. I'm honored that they have allowed me to get on this horse, and I'm sure he's gonna take a week of tuning after this. So I'm really, really grateful. But I get to ride shiny work boots, aka Rio. Kind of the only pattern I know. However, I am a member of MattMillsRaining.com, so I do, I should know all the patterns better, but I've been looking at more of the stuff I can apply to barrel horses, so guilty. <laughs> and which way would you like me to start facing? Let's go, let's go to the left. Okay, am I okay starting here or should I get in the middle? Let's go right there. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna, we, so you've done circles, you've done, you've done a lead change. Right. We're gonna do some spinning, we're gonna do some stops. Okay. And then we're gonna have you do a pattern. Okay, Since cool. I did a pattern, you got the Okay. Pattern. All right, so let's spin him to the left six times. Are my reins short enough? They look great. Okay, six times. So you guys have a PGA golf thing that you do between each spin. Okay, so you get done. I've never heard somebody describe it like You've that. You stopped and now, <clears throat> okay. <laughs> Hang on. You've been wild. <laughs> and then, you know, we kind of, we kind of just a little bit let him know the leg wiggles a little. You, you okay. put it down, this is exactly what you got to do. That's funny. And then a lot of people go like a top. Don't do that. Does that help? That doesn't help. <laughs> yeah. Sit back, sit do still, that. sit straight. I like to keep my core pretty tight. Yeah. So here. Yeah. 
and I'm going to pull with a little bit of pressure, yep. or do I keep? I'm going to stay pre-centered. A little bit of pressure. pressure. So, so three ways you can speed them up. Okay. With your hand. Okay. okay. If these are spinal off that neck rein, with your leg and with your voice. Okay. So. I've seen you overspin at a show, and you've never done it in your life. Like you spun five times or three times or something. And I was just like, that's what, that would happen to me. It could happen. That would happen to me. It could, like I could go happens. the wrong way. Okay, I'm going to stop stalling now. All right, you got to go. Okay. Squeeze your spur in a clock. Squeeze. Poke him once. There you go. There it is. Stop. Awesome. Is that okay? I have yeah. turned. Hang on. Damn. <laughs> nah, nah, nah. Welcome to rain. Damn zero. Welcome to rain. <laughs> I was supposed to have a big yeah. move and be low. You know? <laughs> Ugh, and then sit there. And then wiggle again. Hang on. I went so fast, my reins are over here. Alright, let's go the other way. Okay. But don't have your hand quite as high. I was here. I yeah. need to be here. It was fine, but yeah, just yeah, there okay. you go. Yep. Right there. I don't know how to count. You got five. That was, was good. Counting? I don't know. I whatever. Was like, I was good. So I was cool. going, man, this was good. Yeah. I think I'm you're going to need a reining horse now. I want one so bad. All right. Yes. Let's go to the left. Spin again? Yeah. Five times. Five times. Okay. Keep that this inside leg off a little bit more. Okay. There you go. There you go. There you go. Wow. Yeah. Okay. Are we there? That was awesome. Okay. Hey, that was, I learned a little bit the second time around. What's up, players? I turned. That was awesome. <laughs> I feel like for me, what would have been the hardest thing out of everything is slow circles. Because I feel like I could really ruin one for you by making the fast circles fast. And I or could, the slow circles fast? Yeah, but slow circles. Like, and then the fast I circles. That's why I wanted to try it. I was like, okay, That's I can off. go slow. Yeah, yeah you can. The horse has a lot to do with that. Yeah. And a small... Fast. Now, yeah. <laughs> that's like for me, like a horse that a horse like this, I do real well. Right. Because I'm, I run a little hot. Same. So, so if you Same. put me on a one that's a little hot, that sometimes is not. Uh, Lolo's brother is like a runaway freight train. Yeah. And so that's the one my friend Kelsey's been riding, and I'm like, you walk out there and you're just like, please don't let me kick and catch air, and like get up to his ears, and like, I have to just like, all the way in. <laughs> beg myself not some, to ride hard. Do some woosah stuff. Yeah. How much pressure am I holding in the stop? Well, pr ideally, not any more than that, which you just did. Okay. Yeah. I'm here. And, I mean, in a perfect world, Sorry. your hand's on their mane. Right. Not very often. Depends on the footing. Sometimes, the, you know, like our ground's pretty good here, but right. if it's real heavy, you've got to pull have to hold more. Them. Right. right. Then we adjust with the sliding plates. So, you know, if I know I'm going somewhere really slick, I'll make the shoes a little, you know, smaller. Maybe go okay. to a seven, eight, three quarter. Same if I'm in deep ground, we might go to a little more surface area okay. on the slider. But the big thing on, on that stop is that they don't feel, which this is exactly what you were telling me on that rundown. You don't want them to feel that you want to slow down or stop. Right. You want to commit all the you way down. I'm not worried down. about that. <laughs> My big fear is like, where do their front feet go? And then in this stop, like depending on the pattern, if I don't let them sit still after they stop, that's a penalty. Or if I don't back them all the way, or if I stop before the cone, then that's a penalty, and I don't want to ruin something. You've got, <laughs> there's a lot to this. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> so. Yeah. Everything you're you... talking about is, is right. Okay. You're going to run down there, though, take your legs off and say, well, you're going to okay. be fine. Pretty much anything, like when you're stopping these guys, you want to go as long as you can, like down the arena. Because we're tuning them. Right, because you don't want to anticipate. Because what, what first thing that happens with these guys, they feel your body about halfway down. Almost every amateur rider does it, even pro riders. And then they pop them back up out of it? Well, they, they know that the rider's going to stop because they've stopped them short so many okay. times. And what usually what happens, it's not going to happen to you, get up to speed and you get that, oh my gosh. So then you start kind of getting in panic mode or, or shutdown mode. Okay. They feel it. They start slowing down. And then what happens, it actually makes it worse. And then on the right. front end, then you get the front I've end. seen it. I've yeah. seen it. You in get the, the dashboard. Boom, boom. Okay. The uh, when airbag you... pops out of the horn and all that I good wish stuff. an airbag popped out of the horn. <laughs> no, so you're going to be accelerating. You're going to be grabbing gears all the way to the end. Okay. What I want you to do, so any stopping, we'll just start it off down on that fence. You're going to run that. right down the middle to make it simple. I, I like to have just a couple real simple thoughts. Just pick out a target. Okay. And then just run, you know, run straight to it. And then say, well, that's it. Okay. Cool. So we're gonna, Sounds we wanna really try to, oh, you're simple. gonna, it's gonna be so easy. Okay, I have another question. That's what you say to me before I run barrels. It's like, just <laughs> pick like, where you wanna go and then turn. Yeah. 
Like, it's easy. How do you get them to speed up without climbing on, like, I'm going to ride like this. So I notice you guys just kind of sit back, but I can't take my legs off of them. So, so you're going to, you kind of, kind of keep those legs moving a okay. little. You're going to use your seat. Some guys, you can, you can lean forward a little bit. Okay. You know, like, uh, for, for example, Manny McCutcheon, she gets up over. Yeah. And she, and then, then she, she's got the timing down. It works right. for her. Doesn't really matter. Right. As long as you're mashing on that gas. And so I like to think about it in gear. So I can get the first gear, hold out for a few strides. Okay. Second, okay. third. Because it's like controlled chaos. We want right. them, by the right. end, we want them running hard. Really hard. Okay. Um, but you can't start from the, from the, from the, the very first stride from the standstill. You can't accelerate. You can't just sure. mash on it all the way. Sure. Then they're running like a maniac. Okay. And then either they don't stop or they they get that short stride. They're locked up. You yeah, know, and then they and then they go to the ground that way. We want that deep, okay, stride. I want a plus stop. I, I really need that in my life. Let's get it right now. Okay. So okay. you go Thank walk you down. So just pick out a window pane or something. Okay. And just run down. Let's try to get past that last banner, that Matt Mills banner there. Okay, we're going that way to stop. You're gonna go that way okay. this time. Okay. And you're gonna stop under that last big ass fan, basically, right there. Okay. Past the Matt Mills sign would be my cone. Yeah. Okay. And what lead does he need to be in? Uh, let's take right lead. Right lead. So on our straightaway, it doesn't matter. Just make sure he takes the lead you asked for as okay. well. Okay. Yes. Perfect. I gotta remember that. Yeah! Woo! I think you could be ready to show pretty quick. I mean, she would. Like, really quick. This way. <laughs> Sorry. That, that was a good spin, though. That was a good spin. Well, you were on the money for what you thought yeah. you were going to yeah. do. Yeah. You did not overspin. Okay, now we take a trail ride. In point, yeah, get that awesome. small, slow, a little smaller. Yep. The Rio's like, I thought I was done.
All right, now let's see that speed. I didn't think I'd have to ask twice. <laughs> Perfect, perfect, keep rolling. Okay, you got it. Now sit down, relax. Good job. Pitching some There you go. Nice, nice little pro rain kick. Now just go find the center of the arena again. Do I do run down now? No, no, no. One more. You owe me another fast circle. Yep, yep. Keep running all the way around. One more circle, then a lead change. Yeah, really good. <laughs> We're just getting on and going. Perfect. Now you're going to go around to that corner and then run down and stop. Maybe shorten your range just a little bit. So you're going to get that stop, then just settle. It's going to feel like a long time and then roll back hard. Pick your target out and go. Faster. Then roll back. Right roll back. We're gonna roll back on the other side. Don't let him back up. No, no, you're gonna go around slow, loop around the end here. Shorten your reins. Go a little faster, Fallon, and pull a little harder. No, no, you gotta loop around slow and then go. This time just stop just past the center. Doing the, she's doing the, uh, hey Karen, she's doing the, uh, 
Ty the range. Okay. She's waiting to hear the score. She's waiting here to loosen the cinch. Okay. Owners. We need to talk. We need to talk to the. Yeah. Thank your sponsors. Yeah. Seventy-five. Got a seventy-five from you. Seventy-four and a half. Seventy-four and a half. <laughs> Y'all know I was a sixty-three, so I appreciate that so much. I think we've got we've got a uh, we've got a two twenty-five rolled in there. Yeah. I take my helmet off like I knew it. That's yeah. that's the one. <laughs> then we get the slow motion walk out. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. okay. This was probably one of the coolest days of my life ever because if you've watched my channel for any amount of time I take on kind of a new crazy goal every single year and one year it was jumping and one year it was bodybuilding which was crazy but I did I did good and um, today huh. raining and that was really really cool um, but Matt took on barrel racing and I just you cannot tell me this guy is not one of the best horsemen in the world that was so much fun because <laughs> I got to like nobody was checking my speed you were like going on usually it's like hey back off back off <laughs> Which I mean, hey, there's, there's timing and stuff to this, but it was like, go right. ahead and go. So that, right. that, that, that was so much fun. And I think the big thing for barrel racers is that we kind of battle this thing where people say it's not a real sport or there's not a lot of horsemanship involved. And I think anything that you do at a really low level, everybody can bring you know their own level of horsemanship to. But when you're doing things at a really high level, you can't not be a horseman. And oh, listen, it. I mean, as soon as I took off and that horse, when I hit that first barrel, got right to that spot and that horse just dropped right in and turned <laughs> and I felt that move. You can't just get off the couch or just grab any horse. I mean, right. that's, that's, there's a lot of practice and time that went into that, which I mean, there's I could feel that in Well, thank you for riding her so good. She doesn't even need yeah. to be tuned. So I'm really stoked about that. Um, I hope that Rio <laughs> doesn't need a huge tune up. I pulled him out of a couple of stops, which, you know, I'm new. So <laughs> I think he's completely fine. You <laughs> didn't do you. anything he hasn't seen. You did. I mean, I mean, you got through the whole pattern pretty darn good. Like, we had a lot of questions in the pattern. I think <laughs> you could be, illegal. Yeah. Well, we get a little Bluetooth speaker or something in That's there. That's got to be illegal. It'd be like NASCAR. You just it is illegal. But, is but, it? Yeah. But, uh, if you're not cheating, you're not trying. I know. <laughs> that could have been like for us. We can do stuff like that. Yeah. So you know, I get to like yell a lot of things. But and Karen and Mary Beth yelled for me, which is great because that's the big thing that like when we have a when we have a rodeo that has no people in the stands for that day, yeah. you're just relying on the energy because our horses do so much better with a full performance. They yeah, yeah, harder. yeah. So when there's a slack, you don't, I need to just cart them around with us to like oh, yell. They're really, they, they are really good at that. They're for hire. <laughs> so, be great. Yeah, and they travel. So, yeah. <laughs> That'd be great. Yeah. Um, well, we're going to do, we're going to team up on Instagram and YouTube to do a big giveaway. Rules of that are coming really, really soon. So make sure to follow Matt Mills Raining. Yep. Is that right? On yep. Instagram? You got it. You got it. Matt Mills Raining on YouTube. Yep. And then go to mattmillsraining.com to check out the subscription where you can learn rollbacks and spins and lead changes and body control, and you name it. Patterns yeah. and starting colts and groundwork. There's every literally everything. So really complimentary to the horse boss challenges that are starting on the seventh. So be ready for that. All right, you guys, please subscribe. Ding that notification bell. And as always, don't forget to count your blessings, drink your protein, say thank you to Jesus. See you next time. Did you love this vlog but wish you could get even more training tips and horse content to apply to your training sessions? Make sure to check out thehorseboss.com. I'm excited to be your coach.